our union government and the Ministry of Education put, putting forward uh, the budget of this uh, uh, year. At present, not more than 3% of colleges run PhD programs and not more than 35% of colleges run PG programs. Now, if this, uh, this vision of the national education policy is to be implemented in a, a proper manner, then we should focus on upgrading colleges and those institutions which lack basic infrastructure like laboratories and libraries to, uh, so that those institutions, the colleges in the far-flung areas can also provide PhD programs and PG programs. Implementing national education policy is not going to be easy because this is a humongous task ahead. And if this was implemented in phase-wise from the very beginning, it would have been easy. But we are coming for an education reform after three decades, more than three decades. So abruptly reforming this existing education system is not going to be easy. In higher education, I must uh, also put forward that accessibility is still an issue because the uh, gross, uh, gross enrollment ratio, the national gross enrollment ratio is 26%, whereas the gross enrollment ratio for the settled tribes is only 17.2%, which indicates that the settled tribe, the students uh, belonging to the settled tribe community, they, do, they still don't have the accessibility. The students belonging to that community, they cannot come to the cities so easily. So we cannot expect them to avail it, but we must help them avail it. Vocational education, as uh, emphasized uh, in, in uh, national education policy, we must come forward with a concrete plan that how we are going to implement vocational education. Because till date, no vocational education in the schools have been implemented in proper manner. In the context of the Northeast India, including Sikkim, I would like to stress on one point that the syllabus are given by the CBSC and other national level boards, they don't include the history, the culture, and the geography of the Northeastern India. So it seems that somewhere our students from the mainland India, they fail to understand where the Northeastern states are. So this is very important that in the schools, uh, especially in the board like the CBSC, ISC, and ICSE, that the history, geography, culture, and other aspects of Northeastern India also be uh, included and taught all over India so that uh, Northeastern states don't feel the exclusion from the rest of the country. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to East Mojo. For any queries, put them down in the comments section below and press on the bell icon for notifications.